I had the grandest time the other afternoon. Really, nothing so exciting has happened to me since I got married. Jim asked me to go see the White Sox game with him. And so in honor of the occasion, I wore my new White Sox. Oh. And we sat way up in the white. Uh, is that right, Jim? Jim's crazy about uh, baseball, but I don't understand much about it. Uh, he, he told me what? Uh, Should we practice it first? Oh, uh, see the Cubs play the Tigers. The, the what? And do you know the Cubs play the Tigers? And do you know? I waited around that zoo all afternoon, and that man never did show up. Well, as I was telling you, Jim asked me to go see the White Sox game with him. And so, in honor, uh, in, in honor of the occasion, as I told you, I wore my new White Sox, and we sat way up there uh, in the top of the grandstand, and we sat right behind Miss Maisie. Oh, Lenore, Miss Macy had on the most beautiful hat. I just couldn't keep my eyes off them. And just about that time, Jim says, do you see the breastplate that one of the players is wearing? I said, yes, I'm going to get me one just like it, and at the same place, too. <laughs> of course, I was talking about Miss Macy's hat. Well, as we went along, uh, Jim, all of a sudden, uh, everybody, everybody started hollering. I asked Jim what they were hollering about. And he said that one of the players had just knocked a fly. It just hit a fly. Lenore, you would think that that crowd enjoys nothing. I. He just knocked what? a fly, or he just What's hit a fly. A fly? What's a fly? I guess it did bother him buzzing around his head that way. And then they started yelling again, and this time Jim said that one of the players had just knocked a foul. Lenore, you would have thought they enjoyed hitting a poor bird that way. Well, just about that time, Jim said that his gang had just given him the high sign and asked if he could go join them. And I said, yes, and may, may I go too? And he said that his gang didn't like women folks. So he went off <laughs> down there somewhere to be with his gang and I sat there all alone, not understanding anything about the game. game. And after a while, the whole crowd started hollering. And I looked around to see where Jim was. And there he was down there. And he was hollering. There he was over there somewhere. I could see him, and he was hollering, Come home, you fool! Come home! Yeah. Well, Lenore, I started down there, and when I got halfway, Jim yelled, Go back, you fool! Go back! <laughs> really, Lenore? Jim never had talked to me like that in all of our married life. So I turned around and started back. And just then I caught my heel and I fell and I slid. <laughs> and you know what that man did? He yelled, slide, fall, slide. <laughs> well, I did slide. I slid until I hit a post and I stopped. And just then, every man, woman, and child in that audience stood up and hollered, The White Sox! The White Sox! They've got to run in them! They've got to run in! Oh, boy. Bye.
this time I was really. I stood up like a Joan of Arc, and I faced that crowd, and I hollered back, I don't care if they do have four. I've got another pair 